Imagine waking up every 30 seconds, unsure of where you are or what just happened. This is the daily reality for Clive Waring, often called the man with a 30-second memory. His story is both fascinating and heartbreaking, highlighting the critical role memories play in our lives. Clive Waring wasn't always like this. He was a gifted musician and conductor in England, known for his remarkable talent and extensive musical knowledge. He played multiple instruments and led orchestras, earning admiration from peers and audiences alike. He had a fulfilling life, with a loving wife, children, and a job he cherished. However, in 1985, when Clive was 47 years old, everything changed. He fell seriously ill with a rare brain infection called encephalitis. This illness, caused by a virus typically responsible for cold sores, reached Clive's brain, causing severe swelling. The inflammation damaged a critical part of his brain called the hippocampus, which is essential for creating and storing new memories. Clive's condition was so severe that doctors doubted his survival, giving him only a 20% chance of making it through. His wife Deborah was beside herself with worry. Miraculously, after receiving intense medical treatment for several days, Clive began to recover physically. However, it soon became apparent that his brain had been profoundly affected. Initially, Clive's behavior was erratic and alarming. He would dance around the hospital, jump out of closets, and once even tried to leap out of a moving car. Doctors had to administer medication to calm him down. As Clive gradually comprehended the extent of his condition, he became deeply distressed, and his wife recalled that he cried for an entire month. Clive was diagnosed with anterograde amnesia, which means he is unable to form new memories. Every 7 to 30 seconds, his brain resets, causing him to forget what just occurred. It's as if he is perpetually waking up in a state of confusion, unaware of his surroundings or how he got there. This condition is so severe that he even forgets what he is eating while he is still eating it. In addition to anterograde amnesia, Clive also suffers from retrograde amnesia, which has erased most of his memories from before he became ill. He knows he's married, but has no recollection of his wedding. He's aware that he has children from a previous marriage, but he cannot remember their names or faces. This condition is incredibly challenging for Clive. He understands that something is wrong with him, but he cannot remember what it is. At one point, Clive attempted to keep a diary to help him remember things. However, he would forget that he had already written in it and ended up writing the same entries repeatedly. Instead of aiding his memory, the diary only highlighted the severity of his condition. Deborah, Clive's wife, wrote a book titled Forever Today, detailing their life together and Clive's struggle with his memory loss. She explains that every time Clive blinks or looks away, it's like he's seeing everything for the first time when he looks back. He forgets everything he just saw, making his world a constantly shifting and bewildering place. Despite his severe memory loss, Clive retains some abilities. He can still perform routine tasks like shaving and showering because these skills are stored in a different part of his brain that was not affected by the encephalitis. Remarkably, Clive can still play music beautifully. His fingers remember how to play instruments, even though his mind does not recall learning them. When he plays music, he seems more like his old self, demonstrating the unique and resilient nature of musical memory. Now, 84 years old, Clive has lived with this condition for almost four decades. His story has been chronicled in books, documentaries, and news reports, offering valuable insights into how our brains work and how memories are formed. Clive's story underscores the significance of memories in our lives. Memories shape our identity, connect us to our past, and link us to the people we love. Without them, like Clive, we would be adrift in a constantly changing world where everything seems unfamiliar. Despite the immense difficulties Clive faces, there is still love in his life. His wife Deborah has stood by him all these years, visiting him regularly. Every time she enters the room, Clive is overjoyed to see her, as if it has been years since they last met. 
even if she only stepped out for a moment. This enduring affection shows that while memories may fade, emotions can remain strong.